Hi, hello, hello, hello. Pisces. Okay, I'm so sorry, guys. I've been doing a lot of these. I'm like, who am I reading? Okay, Pisces, all right. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. Don't don't charge it to my heart, y'all. Charge it to my head. I was like, hold on, who? Um, Pisces, the, the uh, intuitive, the imaginative the mystic, um, the spiritual, um, the diplomatic one, um, you know, the sensitive. So Pisces, let's get into it. Let's see what's happening uh, for my Pisces. Okay, so when I was uh, meditating off camera, what I got for you was like, there's like a man sitting and like one side of his face was falling off, like almost like it was a mask. It was falling off, and then he, as he uh, started to get up, because um, he was sitting, like, that same side where the mask had fallen off his face, like, the, the rest of his body, that one side of his body started falling off. So, I don't know, it's like, half. Like, he was, like, a half. Half of him looked different. Half of him was the same. Something's shedding. Half. I don't know. You could be mixed. Half. Half and half. Maybe, like, half and half. I don't know. Um, maybe you could be getting the half of things or half truth or something is falling off. Um, the mask is falling off, but it's not the full, it's not the full manifestation of a thing. Maybe you're getting um, to use half of your um, like intuition or your brain or your, I don't know, something about half, half of your body. I don't know, one half. Let's see. Let's see what's going on here. Let's see how, how we can make sense of this. 50%. I don't know. If someone's giving you 50%. Half. They're only doing 50% of the work. Maybe they're telling half the truth or this is you. Let's see what's happening for my Piscean. So, Ten of Cups, that's you, Pisces, with the Knight of Pentacles. So, um, dedicated, loyal to sometimes the Ten of Cups can talk about f falseness or fake or yeah, falsehood. It, like this is the sense of happiness. It's not actually happiness, right? Um, it could be happiness. It could be false. And we did have the mask falling off. The Knight of Pentacles, you've been doing something for a very long time. You've been acting like you're happy. You've been acting. You've just been um, going with the flow. You've been dedicated and, devo and devoted to seeing it through but there's a lot of boredom discontentment in a certain situation it says inject some fun so that maybe this happiness can be a uh, genuine it can be true i don't know you set the stage for true happiness true love someone's it's like failure to pull the trigger or to make it what is this about? The page of swords is five of the yeah, so it's like lack of confidence in something moving forward and you getting what you want. There's a lot of uncertainty, um speculation and lack of clarity. Also it's just like you, you don't want to feel like, I don't know, it's like somebody's trying to protect themselves from getting used or being used or feeling like they got used. The page of swords is you're wondering, you have questions, you're inquisitive about where someone's going to go when they leave. This could be young people, a younger person. <sighs> what is this about? The Queen of Wands, the Queen of Cups. So it could be like a same-sex relationship where there's two people doing a lot. You know? The Four of Pentacles and the Will of Fortune. If it's not same-sex, then there's like um, disagreement or there's argument or there's friction. And there's like spec once again speculation, um, like gossip. You could be the subject of gossip in terms of what you do. Listen to your intuition, and listen to your intuition, then activating. Four of Pentacles to hold something or hold it together. The Wheel of Fortune. Okay, so. There's like a masculine energy who's only showing up in, in energy form. There's two women here. 
who possibly know about each other. If there is a masculine here, someone's trying to get scoop or get the insight or get questions answered about another woman. If there is, so someone's feeling insecure, or uncertain about their position in a particular relationship. It's either you Pisces or it is a Sagittarius. Someone feel, it feels like somebody shut down or closed off or someone's closed off their heart space, closed off um, in regards to moving this relationship forward or transforming or changing. Your psychic abilities could be heightened in regards to maybe the opposite sex right now because um, you got suspicion here, speculation. Yeah, there's that the man here. He's only showing up in like energy. The moon, there's a feminine energy and judgment. So it's like, we got three major arcanas in a row. It's like, um, whatever illusion this person was trying to cast, somebody is really trying to get out of it and see through it. It's like someone knows that they've been under some fog or under some illusion. They know that they need to come out of this. They've been getting a half truth. Somebody's been lying to themselves or other people. Somebody is coming into the energy of awakening and making a decision to either move on or stay in something that it possibly won't get you what you want. But making a decision here um, and listening to the call, hearing the call, answering the call, moving on. Someone is going to revive what was supposed to be dead. We already talked about it. We already made a decision about it. Someone's going to relive it, revive it, and then possibly bury it again so we never have to deal with it again. Because something is resurfacing here. But it's the only way that you can move forward is to deal with the skeletons of the past, deal with the burial, which you never really had a ceremony. It was just a burial. So something about a cover-up and something that's falling off. This could even be like a literal cover-up. Of some somebody's ill intentions, their their wrongdoing, it could be coming out. It could have something to do with money because somebody was in an uncertain place. Maybe they stole money. Maybe they stole opportunity, position. So there's a, a big unveiling, a discovery. Somebody, this was hidden, hidden enemy, hidden motive, hidden secrecy. And it could be coming from like a feminine energy. All right, let's see. Six of Swords, the Star card, Eight of Swords, King of Wands. Could be coming out that somebody still stuck on someone, still looks them up from time to time. Someone desires. Desire, somebody's seeing a bigger picture desire to be still clinging to maybe reconciliation or a coming back together or an opportunity to get yeah, to reconcile to move forward. It could be a discovery that somebody's still holding on to what is happening here, what is going on for my um. Piscean people, because this then got messy. It's cover ups. It's someone's un discovering that somebody is still engaging in maybe some sex only relationship to where they have to travel to this person. They're still stuck there. There could even be somebody looking somebody up on, you know, the internet, uh, virtually. Someone that's moved on, though. I don't think the other person is waiting for the uh, this king of wands to look them up. This person is far, far gone. Somebody could, like a big wish fulfillment happen in the beauty and fashion industry here. What is going on? Okay. So this came in reverse. Understand you have complete control in this situation. So maybe you don't. Trying to get control. A match made in hell. So maybe it was bad. Someone's trying to turn this negative relationship into a good. Wow, okay, I'm the devil spawn. Somebody is just altogether evil. A demon. Not a good thing at all. Just, you know, um, the mask is falling off. And now the true person is emerging. You know, that's my true intention. 
it's coming out. It's being made real, manifest. That somebody is um, a hellcat. Okay? Um, somebody is like doing maybe sex magic. I masturbate to the thought of you. You have people laughing at me. This relationship is over. So somebody is, is something publicly coming out. We saw that. We saw scandal. We saw cover up. Yeah, somebody is definitely out of here. Um, someone is not even admitting shit that they've done. And they're not asking for forgiveness. There could be somebody here who doesn't have respect for women. Okay. I, I still am like a little dumbfounded. There's like major cover up. Somebody's under judgment. This could be spiritual judgment for what they've done. And somebody's trying to get away from this person because they know that they're getting, you know, judgment. I think on one of the readings, collective reading I did, Pisces, somebody was like almost like demon possessed or allowing themselves to be possessed by, you know, maybe dark energy. Um, it could be a young person. It could be you. It could be somebody else. I don't know. What is going on here? Somebody's mask is falling off. Yeah. Yeah, they're falling off. And they're coming out as the drama, 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 drama chameleon. So they were a chameleon. Their mask is falling off. They were acting like they would shift, shape, change. Act like they're not the drama. But they were the drama. They bring the drama. It is them. I don't know who this is. Whether it's you, Pisces, or the next person, or the next person. Yeah, Queen of Swords, someone's seeing the truth of the matter, the final, making a final decision. Someone's understanding their value, too. Horses, that somebody has many horses in a stable. <clears throat> somebody has a lot of options. Somebody don't want me to tell this. They got a lot of options. Um, they were casting this illusion, this falsehood. Like, we're going to do this and do that. We're going to get married. We're going to do... But there's, there's other options here. And whomever this is, they don't even have respect for women. Um, one more card for Pisces. Birds. A lot of chatter. Somebody could be like a bird brain, younger. Um, a lot of chatter with the page of swords, of the subject of gossip. Um, someone's trying to gain information to spy. Um, someone's trying to spy. Someone's childish. Ooh. Okay, I want to leave you with an angels and ancestors card. What card really sums this up for Pisces? It looks just like it's drama. And somebody is just not in the best energy. Someone is negative, low vibrational. The shapeshifter can't make it up. Transform and unveil your gifts. Somebody is unveiling. Or like the mask is coming off. Somebody was trying to be a transformer, the shapeshifter. But the mask came off. It was falling off. Okay. Somebody was trying to um, be a chameleon. Trying to act like they were a good person when they really aren't. This is somebody who is just like innately bad. Like they just, they just are. It just is. Um, they're pessimistic. They're bad for, for themselves. Yeah. They're bad for everything. Um, just get away from this. Um, what is this about? I'm so curious. Yeah, yes. And no, you could be dealing with a Scorpio. So my, the cards are telling you to choose choose a new direction, okay? And listen to your intuition. And if you need to get out of something, ask for help from others. Meditation is going to bring you some real answers about a particular person. Some, I'm getting like a younger person. Yeah, sorry guys. Like a younger person. Um, I 
yeah, with the birds here. Maybe the company that somebody is keeping. Somebody is absolutely fake. And, you know, of a dark energy. And the other person is light. I don't know. This, this is um, an interesting energy. What are they hiding? Oh, yeah. Somebody is, like, demon-possessed. Look what came out. Or just, like, their mind is bad. No peace, sleepless nights, constant company, always on the phone, never wanting silence. This is somebody who don't like, you know, calm energy because, first of all, their soul is, you know, tormented. So they love loudness and craziness and chaos and they don't sleep at night. They always want company. They're always on the phone. They don't want silence. In the silence, it speaks volumes. It speaks truth. Somebody got made like a black heart. This, whomever this is, they don't take care of their responsibilities, their children, their bills, household tasks. Somebody is reaping the harvest from the seeds they've sown, good or bad. And somebody is always using that sacral chakra, that lower muscle. They're overly sexual and overly aggressive. They hate when people are extremely happy. They just absolutely hate it. And this person is not happy. This person has like psychopathic tendencies and that's why the mask is falling off. They can play so many sides and so many, you know, positions and be so many things to different people. Um, they function in society. We think of psychopath, we think of, yeah, a, you know, um, a, a padded room, you know, an asylum, a crazy house. But no, you deal with psychopaths e each and every day. They, they're highly functional in society. You know, they're just, they compartmentalize everything. And some things like emotion and empathy, sympathy, there's no compartment for that. They don't possess it, okay? Uh, the person is extremely selfish. Could be you, could be someone else. This is a, an escape, an escapist also. We'll leave. When the time, when the tough gets, when times get tough, they will leave. When it gets going, when it gets rough, they will leave. Um, they will do what's best for them. This is an extremely selfish person. This is somebody who's keeping up gossip. This is somebody who's a warmonger. Okay. Uh, this just looks like somebody who's just fake, 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 fake. And somebody is finding it out. That there were so many horses in the stable. So many other options. Or so many options that this person was keeping. Um, they keep up a lot of chatter. Um, the Queen of Swords, they could be, I really feel like she's in the reverse, um, could be kind of needy, clingy, um, a bitch altogether. Um, definitely, I'm hearing like psychopathic, um, dark, 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 dark. This is not a good energy. If you're dealing with somebody like this, run and run now. And I mean, unless you love the drama, because that's what they will bring. And if you are this person, seek help. You know, we all were you know, something that we didn't want to be at one period of time in our life. Just be better. Choose to be better. You can choose it. You can choose happiness also. Um, somebody's just not in, in the highest vibration. Someone doesn't want happiness. Somebody wanted somebody to be bound, stuck. Somebody's extremely jealous of somebody's fortunate time. Um, someone was trying to do like binding spells on someone. This is too much. I'm getting out of this energy. Okay. Thank you. Take care. Many blessings to you. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. What part resonates for you? If you took something from the reading, you could buy me a coffee. The link is below. It says buy L a coffee. And I want to shout out to London, uh, California, Chicago, Houston, Atlanta, Philadelphia, Dallas, New York, um, Florida. I have high viewership in those places and I want to say thank you. Let me know where you're viewing from. All right. I'm live every Tuesday and Thursday night at 930 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Take care.